Despite being no larger than a chestnut, the dung beetle possesses a remarkable ability. It can constantly monitor the defecation behavior of distant wild animals. Elephants, for example, defecate almost every hour with massive quantities left behind each time. Animal feces naturally contain various volatile organic compounds, which the dung beetle can detect and identify with remarkable precision using its antenna. This extraordinary skill dates back to the age of dinosaurs. Over millions of years, dung beetles have evolved to feed on feces, honing their sensory abilities. Their antenna can now detect feces from hundreds of meters, sometimes even kilometers away. Using chemical cues, dung beetles can even pre-select their preferred feces. And once a target is chosen, they charge forward without hesitation. But the journey is not without challenges. Rolling a dung ball under the scorching African sun can be a difficult adventure. Summer ground temperatures can soar to 60 degrees Celsius. And the dung beetle's black armor is not well suited for heat dissipation. To cope, they perform a fascinating cooling dance. After traveling a short distance, the beetle climbs atop the dung ball, spins in place, and pauses. Thermal imaging reveals the secret. The dung ball remains cooler than the surrounding ground, allowing the beetle to lower its body temperature during these pauses. But the spinning serves another purpose, navigation. The dung beetle uses the sun's position as a natural compass, constantly adjusting its direction as the sun moves across the sky. This ensures the dung ball is rolled in a straight line. However, when the sun reaches its peak at midday, it becomes a poor point of reference. So how does the beetle stay on course? Nature has equipped the dung beetle with another tool. Its sensitive antenna can detect wind direction using the breeze as an alternative guide. As the sun sets, a new challenge arises. How can the beetle continue without its primary guide? Around 45 minutes after sunset, the sky reveals a hidden guide. Polarized light. Invisible to human eyes, polarized light patterns continue to guide the dung beetle's path. Even in rainy weather, the dung beetle can rely on this hidden light for navigation. At night, nocturnal dung beetles switch to a different navigation system, the moon. Like a natural GPS, the moonlight guides their journey. But what about cloudy nights when the moon is hidden? Unfortunately, the dung beetle's vision is not sensitive enough to detect the faint starlight above.
A type of dung beetle observed in this region is currently the only known insect capable of navigating using the Milky Way. These small and seemingly ordinary creatures constantly use the vast cosmos to guide their way. Their impressive navigation skills are entirely managed by a brain smaller than a sesame seed. Every male dung beetle enjoys rolling dung balls ostentatiously, as it is the perfect opportunity to display their wealth and strength to potential mates. However, being too flashy comes with its risks. Yet, this precious treasure will soon be claimed by another dung beetle. As long as they possess such an asset, winning the heart of a mate comes naturally. Even without female followers nearby, the male dung beetle has another clever trick. He releases a love signal into the air. The glands located on his abdominal plates secrete pheromones, which are dispersed by flicking his hind legs. These pheromones drift as white wisps through the air, reaching several kilometers away. The female's antenna can filter molecules containing pheromones from the air, and they are entirely drawn to this chemical signal. Before the female arrives, the male continues to release pheromones, demonstrating extraordinary patience. Finally, his persistence pays off. Upon meeting for the first time, they touch antenna to exchange identity information. Only after confirming the other is a mature member of the opposite sex do they begin the most challenging journey of their lives. The male dung beetle selects a spot with soft soil where they will bury themselves together. Standing atop the dung ball, the male tirelessly encourages his partner. Using only his strength, he eventually digs a hole half a meter deep. Here, they will produce their only offspring. female will even add her own dung to the nursery ball, passing vital digestive bacteria to the next generation. Around three months later, a new life will emerge from the ground. Relying on its sensitive antenna, the young beetle will seek dung, continuing the natural cycle of the dung beetle's mission. The dung beetle's journey, driven by ancient instincts and incredible sensory abilities, is a testament to the wonders of the natural world. A tiny creature, yet so perfectly adapted for its role in the circle of life.